Well, hello and good day. I hope you're doing well. Um, I just wanted to pop in with a quick update because it's been a little while since I posted a video and I honestly don't know when I'll get the next one ready. Um, so I just wanted to share an update about, you know, what's been going on and, and um, yeah, just <laughs> keep you in the loop and not just like disappear on you. So we've been in Arizona for about a month now and uh, during that time, Frank's um, arthritis has really, really gone downhill in his in his feet, um, in his back feet especially. So we saw a vet about it um, because uh, one of the medications he takes we couldn't stock up on before coming and then it's not available in the US so we had to get on a new one anyways. Uh, it's uh, The vet told me that what's going on with his back feet is called torsional hyperflexion and it's it's really, really gone downhill super fast recently. His uh, foot is kind of like all, like getting all clawed up and, and sort of twisted. And um, he actually hasn't come on a walk with me since we've been in Arizona. Uh, he hasn't been more than probably 100 meters from the van uh, since we got down here. Uh, he just he doesn't want to walk unless it's like to go to the bathroom. He'll go have a few sniffs and that's about it. Um, he's not up for much. He just sleeps a lot of the day. He's really happy to lounge in the sun. And um, I've been playing with him in the van. He likes playing laying down. <laughs> and uh, so we've been doing a lot of that, just trying to uh, keep him engaged, and entertained, and, and it makes him really happy when I play with him. And so. Of course, he loves his treats, um, but aside from that, um, yeah, he's he's not he's not doing much, and, um, and so his walk has has gotten pretty bad. It's it's really obvious that there's something wrong. I mean, there has been for a while. I get comments pretty much every day pointing out that he's hobbling or limping, and I know <laughs> I live with him. I see it every time he walks and it breaks my heart and having to read comments also makes me not want to post videos or be online it's it's this has been really hard on me to watch him go downhill super fast I have several videos filmed from our time here in Arizona and I think part of why I haven't really managed to edit them is because I'm just dreading hearing about you know how Frank's doing <laughs> uh, like I know um, and so yeah I've been going by myself or with my friend um, Justin for walks most days I've been really lucky to spend a lot of time with him over the past month uh, Frank and I met him on the Pacific Crest Trail so we've hiked about a thousand miles together um, he's really special to me and Frank and Frank's really special to him and I, I mean I'm a special to him too but um so Frank's been really happy to you know get to spend a bunch of time with his friend we're on our own now um camels through hiking the Arizona trail <laughs> and so yeah I'm just like uh we're just spending some time it's actually my birthday tomorrow I'm gonna be 38 so I don't think I'm gonna get up too much I'm probably just gonna take a really easy day um with Frank so I spent a lot of time just watching Frank and a lot more time lately um, napping or laying in bed just to have quality time with Frank because like he's not coming for walks with me he's not up to much and so um, I don't want to let these last years together slip away with him sleeping and me not engaged with him aside from his limbs <laughs> he's healthy like he's he's a healthy boy he's still really feisty he's got a lot of life in him um and he's in a pretty good mood most of the time so um it's been a hard couple years and uh i've come to realize that it's gonna continue to be hard yeah i don't really expect things to get any easier so um but it has hit really hard these past couple weeks as I've seen um, him just go downhill in terms of his mobility really fast and so we've had uh, we've been recommended to see an orthopedic surgeon or something to see about that or to look into braces so when we're back in Canada we'll do that 
Um, it's just logistically a bit tough to do it down here. Um, and I, I prefer to just go to his vet. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, it's been tough. I haven't had the motivation to work at all to edit. Um, often when I open my computer, Frank will just kind of cry and like want me to like come be with him. And he, yeah, so, I mean, I just listen to him whenever he asks me to like come be with him. Um, but I think he's doing pretty well in terms of like pain management. Um, but I can tell that sometimes he is kind of bummed out that he's not really able to be mobile. And so it sucks to leave him for hikes. I really miss him hiking with me. It's, it's been really, really hard on me to, uh, to have that be part of our past, uh, as opposed to part of our life now, um, even short walks. So yeah, um, in a few days, um, uh, hopefully I'll feel <laughs> like a little better and, uh, I'll be able to start with editing again. So there's no schedule for now on, like, <laughs> I'll just, as I finish videos, I'll just post them and, um, yeah, I'm about like a month behind, so I don't really want to be that far behind. I like to be about two weeks. Um, yeah, I'll just post when I can, and um, yeah, you know, <laughs> just we're just making the best of it every day. Yeah, I honestly believe that, you know, this is, is being harder on me than it is on Frank. I'm doing everything I can to keep him as comfortable as possible, and um, just, you know, cater to his needs as well as I understand them. So I'm, I'm really not looking for medical advice with Frank. You know, it's just one of those things that it's just, it's just, he's just going downhill fast. And I, I don't really think there's much else I can do. Um, I've been throwing everything at him for years and it's just, it's just not really helping. And I'm just coming to terms with that just recently, um, especially the, this past week and, um, yeah, and uh, that is just going to be like the rest of our lives together, so uh, it's been hard. And uh, yeah, I just want to say a huge thank you for all the love and support you share with Frank and I and for tuning into my videos when when I post them. Um, you know, it, that allows me to keep focused on Frank and that's just the greatest gift. So thank you very much and we'll see you soon. <laughs>